Alright, so now we have 14 golden spatula. I mean, uh, what the fuck are they called? Goofy Gooper tokens. No weenie parking anytime. Here we go again with the paddy wagon. Gates are locked. You'll have to find all the keys to unlock the gates. Yep. A bit harder than it sounds. There's the bar itself. The gates out to the main road are locked. You literally just said that. Locked? Then how can we drive out? Floor the paddy wagon and bust through the gates. Sorry, Patrick. For that, we'd need a super crabby paddy deluxe. You can unlock the gates if you find all the keys around the track. Who the hell locks a gate, then leaves the leaves the fucking keys on the you know the track itself? Honestly, I would have rather it be like, you know, we need to we we can bust through the gates, but we need uh the super Krabby Patty deluxes like SpongeBob just said. That would honestly, I think that would have been a little more creative than just get all the keys that are on the fucking track. Uh huh. Alright, let's go ahead and boom. And we can get our first key. Oh, look. I think this gate can. Awesome. Uh, oh, look at that. An extra. And then there's this volcano sauce. Do not touch it. For whatever you do, don't touch it. Alright, let's jump up here. Two of the keys. Fuck this driving control. It's worse. It's really bad here because you're going downhill. Sometimes the game counts it as you're falling. When you're not trying to fall, you're just trying to go down the path. So you can imagine this driving gets a little out of control at times. And when you touch the oil, fucking forget it. You don't have control over the damn car. Alright. So this time I'm gonna go the straight way through here and see if there's a key. Don't touch the road spikes, whatever you do. No. Oh, wait, actually, you know what's something you can do? Destroy the thug's bikes. I mean, we kind of already killed them anyway. I mean, they're not gonna need them. Am I right? Don't touch that. Indeed, there's a key. Three of the keys. All right, I know I got the key up there, so I can go through this way. See what I can find. See, I wasn't trying to jump there, but the game counted it as jumping. That was close. No, go away. All right, don't go up there this time. Come down here, and you get an extra. All right, I thought I'd missed it for a second. I'm like, damn it, game. All right. Come on around through here. All right, one more lap, and I even... I already know where the last key is. Okay, the propellers on the thug tug just broke off. I don't know why. Th is Dennis already here? Maybe. There we go. There's the key. Whee! The gates are open. Alright. Just gotta get through this conundrum. Come on, damn controls. What's... Okay, what's... Here's a question for the comments. Question of the day. Uh, What's a game that you love, but you know has a god-awful driving stage? For me, it's this game. I don't like the driving stage here one bit. I mean, I, it could be worse. And I can, I guess I can understand why they put it in, because, you know, it's the fucking paddy wagon. Fuck you. It's the fucking paddy wagon. You gotta, when you got the paddy wagon, you gotta do some shit with the paddy wagon. But, God, I wish they had made it a better... You see, it, it, like, it did the splatting animation as if I had jumped. God game. Alright, let's NO2 through this gate. There we go. Awesome. Alright, thank God. Well done, SpongeBob and Patrick. Here is your reward. 
All right, goody. Oh, oh my God! I'll let you pit, Mister Whiskers. Here we can go. Oh boy. I, I, I know you all know what this is. Patrick, we've got to start acting like men. SpongeBob. I'll be right back. Acting is gay, men still counts. SpongeBob, wait! Great mine chocolate. <laughs> I'll have two chocolate banana splits with sprinkled fairy stars and goober beans with extra sauce, please. <laughs> uh, you can let go now. I said let go, please. <laughs> what kind of old lady are you? <laughs> That's, it's really over dramatic here than it was in the movie. That's still pretty entertaining. Here we go. Nope. Alright, now. Boop him in there. I even think, uh, okay, the last time I tried to, I played this game, I did make it up to this part and I did beat him. Uh, yeah. And, uh, it seems like, uh, the, I didn't ha I didn't equip the, uh, the force field here. I didn't equip the force field here, but it seems like the force field does more damage. <laughs> oh, hold on, I think. Look at that. Oh yeah. Oh hell yeah. Hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. You're not even trying to get me now. Haha. <laughs> Have fun where you're going. Alright, so now it's gonna go for old lady again. Nope. Sorry, bitch. Where is she? Okay, hold on. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, apparently that counted as a hit. Come at me, bitch! One more hit and he's dead. I wonder if I can just kill him with... Ah, shoot. Ah, shit. No, I didn't, I didn't work on... Alright, you know what? No more playing around. Just kill him. There we go. I love how the monster's just standing in the background, not giving a shit. Patrick, step on it! Yeah. Come on, kiddies. Have some ice cream. Jump for it, Patrick! They didn't even do the Whis so Mr. Whiskers bit right. This creature was vanquished by an even more hideous creature coming from the deep ocean trench. Well, we lost our car again. Thank you God. Find the car. Where's the road? There's the road on the other side of the deep, dark, dangerous, monster-infested trench. <laughs> After gulping. SpongeBob and Patrick decided to throw in the towel. Luckily, Mindy arrived and showed them what was really going on back in Bikini Bottom. Plankton had transformed Bikini Bottom into Planktopolis. The sight of their city convinced our heroes to continue on to Shell City. So, in order to become men, they cried like little babies. But someone was hot on their tail. With no time to lose, Princess Mindy thought of a better idea, and our heroes quickly became men and marched toward the treacherous trench. All right then, rock slide. To get to Shell City, you're going to need to cross the bottom of the trench. You can get to the bottom using this slide. All right then, let's do this. The only way across the trench is along the bottom, but you have to get there first by traveling down the slide, past those sea monsters. Mm, the trench is pretty deep. It's a trench. And very dark. Again, it's a trench. Oh, no sweat, Mindy. We're men now. 
Those sea monsters wouldn't scare a guppy. <laughs> I mean, they're creepy to me. That's the spirit. Now get down there as quickly as possible. Let's do it. Some uh, sea creatures that live down in trenches are some of the creepiest. Like, uh, look up a picture of an angler fish. You know, that fish that attacked uh, Marlin and Dory in Finding Nemo. That's a fucking angler fish. They're fucking scary as shit, dude. Alright. I don't know how these rocks are just levitating in midair, but whatever. Roll with it. Uh, uh, magnets, gravity, shit. There we go. There's our explanation. I'd rather not wake up to that face. At least the music's still awesome. Oh shoot, you know what? I think I missed a trampoline that led to an extra. Whatever. I guess I can go back and get it at a later day. Do you have any free? <laughs> oh, that was close. I almost didn't make that one. Let's see. You know what? I do know where there is is an extra though. No, wait, I think I was wrong. I think I I actually just skipped a bunch of the track, I think, by mistake. Oops. My bad. I honestly did not mean to do that. I would have actually liked to show you guys as much of the track if I, as much of the track as I could, but. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh, maybe I, maybe I didn't skip as much of the track as I thought. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I, uh, I did okay. Uh, I don't know. You need to what? You know what? Actually, don't answer that. I have a feeling we regret hearing the answer. Whatever works. I still love the music here. It's great. I think, uh... In my opinion, I think this is even better than the Battle of Bikini Bottom slide music. Uh, let's see. Uh, but you're lower than it. Yeah, it's just another rock, buddy. Ah, oh, come on, you're a man. Just yank it out. Oof. I was... The music glitched there for a second. I was not paying close enough attention. Careful. Great! A, uh, what the fuck ever that is thing shooting mucus balls at us. Sea monsters are fucking weird on the inside. Alright, kill you, kill you. Oh, I missed one. Damn it. Alright. Concentrate here. Careful! At least I get a checkpoint now. Keep walking, buddy. And we'll keep sliding. here. Oh, awesome. Oh, can I hit the top? Can I hit the top? Okay, wasn't actually expecting that. That got me a little bit. There's a giant waterfall of lava. You figured it would have turned solid by now since it's underwater. There'd just be a lot of steam. Okay, well, never mind. We're actually in front of a lot of steam vents right here. I guess it kind of makes sense. Alright, so, take this. Here's a cave. And I missed those crates, embarrassingly. Indeed. Alright, I see the last leg of the track. Gotta go through this crap one more time. Are we just ever not gonna go... Why does this monster have so many fucking exploding barrels inside of him? Is this like their version of like Pop Rocks candy? I don't know, maybe. I'm gonna hit you in the eye if you don't get out of the way. Let's see. Oh, there's a sea monster right there. I have an itch on my nose. I kind of want to give it a small scratch, but I can't because, well, I guess now I can. There we go. Awesome. We win. Holy cow! You actually did it? 
Did you doubt us? Did you doubt my skills of this joystick right here, Mindy? Hm, I am insulted. Of course we did. We're men. Yeah, right. Here's your reward. Uh, fucking token for a kid's ice cream parlor. You made it through it, like, going down a trench that's gonna be filled with monsters. Here's a fucking token for ya. Give that to anybody else and they would be like, Fuck you, buddy. I want money. All right, now that we're men. Now that we're men. Now that we're men. This there place we go. is full of horrible, hideous, and disgusting monsters. You've got to cross the trench to get to Shell City. Yeah. Not not too pretty, if I can say so. Wow. All right. I'm sorry, SpongeBob. You don't have enough Goofy Goober tokens for me to give you the Sponge Bowl. You'll need the Sponge Bowl to defeat the monsters here. Sponge Bowl? Uh, will a cereal bowl do? Unfortunately, no. Sorry, SpongeBob, but you need more Goofy Goober tokens. <laughs> All right, yeah, so the game's gonna send us back some so we can complete challenges to you know, get more Goofy Goober tokens. So that's what we'll do next episode. We'll go back to certain levels and we'll complete challenges to where we get more Goofy Goober tokens. So until that, until we do that next time, thank you all so much for watching. If you like what you saw, be sure to give this channel, or give this video a like, subscribe to the channel for more. Uh, support the channel if you'd wish to by using Gawkbox. The link will be in the description below. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Peace out, my YouTube comrades.